Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's JR, and you are checking out the Sport Brief. Good news! I'm, I, I, I behaved myself, and I said I was not going to talk about this man or try not to say anything about him until there was some type of resolution with his situation. Brett Favre is gone. Good riddance. Goodbye. Uh, nice seeing you, and it was awful that you came to New York and blew your arm out halfway through the season and just blew the season for us. You know? Bye. Now, if you are a uh, Green Bay Packer fan, you are probably also happy that this guy will not come back and do whatever to you. If you are a Minnesota Vikings fan, you may be happy and you may be sad. It depends on who you are and how you feel about the guy. But me personally, I hate long retirements and guys don't know what they want to do and I understand this is this is your career this is something that you've been doing for years but you know what it comes to a point where you know what man it's played out you sat on that who was that who was a uh, wax sports announcer uh what's this bud the one that did the terrible HBO show is St. Louis Cardinals HBO with Artie Lang well you know who I'm talking about but he sat up on that man's show and he's the Blackberry went off excuse me just people talking. He went on that man's show and he said, you know what, if I want to come back, I'm going to do it. And if you don't like it, too bad. Well, I'm glad you're gone. Sayonara. And now that Brett Favre is gone, I know there's no mandatory uh, retirement period for enshrinement into the NFL Hall of Fame. So please, if, if putting Brett Favre in the Hall of Fame is going to keep him retired, let's please do that ASAP. It cannot happen any quicker. And speaking of retirements, I actually walked through my house and I, well, first of all, let me get to that later. I actually thought of some other uh, players in various sports that should please retire. One guy just got inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame. Wore a white suit and brown, looking like a, a grumpy pimp. Ricky Henderson. Retire already, man. You're not playing. What are you going to play? You're going to play, you, you're going to have to play A ball. Ricky is not going to retire until Ricky says, Ricky's retired. That's when we know Ricky's retired. And you know what? I w and, and going back to Brett Favre, can we trade uh, Barry Sanders for Brett Favre? Can we kind of do like a retirement swap and bring a guy that retired prematurely because he played on a god-awful team? Can we bring him back in exchange for Brett Favre? I wish. Uh, uh, Dikembe Mutombo, man, your leg is busted up. Are you gone yet? Uh, Gary Sheffield, can you run on those two legs of yours? Uh, Stephon Marbury, and I know this will probably reach your eyes. This is not to be insulting, Stephon, but go away. Go play in Greece or Italy. Uh, go play for Monte Paschi. Well, well, they probably wouldn't want you anyway out there. But anyway... I was going through my house, you know, I've been doing some cleaning up, and I passed some records, and I was like, you know what, Brett Favre just retired, and it made me think of other things and other people that are retired just like Brett Favre, and right here I have some classic records that I pulled out of my closet, you may also see the dust, and it made me think of guys and, and, and music trends and trends in music that are also going to retire, and let's hope that they do not come back, kind of like Brett Favre. Here we have uh, Rod Stewart. Look at that hair. Let's hope Rod Stewart's hair never makes a comeback. What do we have here? We have something that else that is also retired that I hope, well, we know we will never see again, is Aretha Franklin's beauty. Oh, man, she was hot. Look at Aretha Franklin. Look at her. Look at that. She is fine. We will never see that again. Look at this. Uh, Richard Roundtree. Shaft. Look at that. Angry black man, angry face. That's retired. No more shaft goes to Africa. That's not happening. Here, Lionel Richie. His hair, his sweater is retired. Well, maybe not. We see guys, uh, Kanye West, and guys are walking around looking like this all the time. Maybe not the hair. What is this? Elton John sunglasses. I think they are quasi and semi-retired. You know, little Elton John. Now, what do we have here? Michael Jackson. He is definitely retired, but I think he may have enough music to last forever. R.I.P. MJ and Isaac Hayes with the little shaft going on there. So those are some things that are retired, and I think are retired, and I hope Brett Favre joins them. This just 
dust all over the place. You, you know I was clean. I had the records. Was, the records came out the shed here, man. It, but anyway, Brett Favre, good riddance. Don't come back. This is JR. This is the Sports Brief. I hope you enjoy. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Go find me on Twitter also, JR Sport Brief. And if you want to talk to me, oh, I hit you right back on the BlackBerry. And it's actually blinking right now. You see, I got to hit somebody now. Hit me up, JR Sport Brief at gmail.com. Brett Favre, I hope you see this. I hope your kids play it for you. Don't come back, man. You had a good career. Stay away. Bring back Barry Sanders. Peace out, y'all.